Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Marcus Aurelius, and this is Dominions 4, The Thrones of Ascension, Death March of the Penguins. We have researched our level of conjuration, so we're closer to getting the children of the Earth, the guardians of the eternal ice. We may already have it. Soup didn't find anything. More flame bolts appearing, killing more of my people. A lot of blood hunts. Balder, our archmage, was a victim of an assassination attempt. Let's see how he does. He does have the water elemental and the two ancestors. Okay, looks like the assassin manages. Oof, frozen heart, and the assassin took out one of the ancestors. Okay. Kitten the Brave, victim of an assassination attempt. Now, poor Kitten is naked. So, a good hit, and we're in trouble. Oh, up. Oh. <laughs> oh, man. In Soviet Ladane, assassins run from you. <laughs> uh, Battle Nabissia. I am so sick of this damn phoenix. Just by itself, it just wrecks us. I think it, I think it drove Ragnar crazy. I think that's the why Ragnar... Wait, now, Polat, you're doing it too? Ugh. He just keeps, he just keeps throwing these phantasmal warriors at us. He just has air gems to burn. And what's that? Sulfur Haze? Oh man. Another one? I'm sure my little penguins are not happy about that. And he just keeps doing it. He just keeps Sulfur Hazing us. What? Oh, come on now. Oh good. I thought that was the leader. No, it's just a Tundra Warrior and of course the Standard Bear. Standard Bears, man. Suicidal. Suicidal little guys, if ever there was some. Sulfur Haze is ridiculous. Oof, he just blew up the standard bear. Oh man. We lost 23 units, including our lone flag bearer. Cerulean Sea. This is the last little pocket of Pelagian resistance in this particular lake. Ichthyids, I think you can see where it's going. We lost a sea dog. I don't know where they keep coming from, and two wave fighters. Small C, they're trying to take us back from us. Those jerks. Are they going to win? Well, we don't have much guarding it. We did hire some Ichthyids. But it's now a moment for just in case, who was never supposed to be in battle, and Haas, I believe. Haas, to show their worth, show their quality as is said in Lord of the Rings. Now, I like these nets. Nets are fun. Nets cause the enemy to not be able to defend against your attacks until they get out of the nets, then they kill you all. We're also panicking. Haas, or just in case, both are doing it, but one of them managed to panic our own guys as well. Probably not the best use of that. You, Land Chief. Theok. Why don't you stay behind the battle lines? Alright, so, yeah, we held them off. Dead Marshes, a lonely Hydra is terrorizing the province. What? I don't appreciate that. I don't think it's a jerk spell, but there's there's the Hydra. Poison he has, poison fumes, fear, regeneration, a bunch of different heads, multiple attacks, and all we have are some lizards. Whoa. Whoa. Crazy ass super lizards. That was something awesome right there. This makes me so happy, folks. Slayer, down. Slayer, down. Slayer, down. And Slayer. So hopefully we'll not be assassinated much. We took out six assassins in one turn. It seems like that's all that Abyssia is hiring these days. So let's quickly go over what I'm doing. Welcome to Capaldi's TARDIS, our new Archmage. Got him some footwear. I'm going to move them all here, where I'm going to also give them... Him and Stamps both, I'm going to give them Water Elemental Guardians. Stamps I gave some Ancestors as well. I am just out of money completely. I am getting another Ice Devil, getting some Corrupted Ladane. I'm sticking with the regular guys because they're frontline guys, and that's what I need really right now. The Ice, or the Red Throwers are cute and all, but not as necessary. And the Flying guys, they're pretty beastly, but 
they're better when masked, and so I'm just going with frontline guys first. These guys, since they're just both two blood, I'm having them hunt. Only the three blood guys are summoning, because that's how much it takes to summon the corrupted. And then Nefrahim and Dwarf Comic are hunting as well. Who's new, though, besides Capaldi's TARDIS? Well, we have... Anybody here? Nope. Though, everybody here is just waiting patiently to get the rest of what they need. Except for Percival and Tazo, who are moving out. I think they're not going out alone, though. We have a guy that could use a name here, a researcher. Puffinatus is moving down into the ocean with more wave fighters. Yeah, that's really it. All these guys are researchers. Okay, so we have Lone Wolf, our new protector, who's just going to hang out for a minute till we get troops for him. Tokshin, Zane Rogers, and Balder are moving here to take out these barbarians. I'm breaking the siege on Abyssia. There's just no point. There's no point. The Phoenix is just going to tear us all up. We're moving up here to join up with these guys and just wait till reinforcements arrive. Speaking of reinforcements, I've decided just to go for it. And, oh, I forgot about Sneak. Let's move him. Well, I guess let's move him to the capital. And Oh, well, no, actually, we can move him underwater and then move him out. Okay. So hopefully Ur or Machaka doesn't take advantage of this, but I'm going to be leading this province with everybody. I'm bringing all of our heroes here. So ten guys, plus all of our heroes here, including Dre 2 and we're going to shut down this fortress, which would mean that Abyssia can only produce units here, 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 and here. And hopefully we're going to put an end to that, because we're going to move hopefully all these guys here, where their stupid phoenix won't come out and just try to kill us every five minutes. And we, of course we have troops coming up. We're moving these guys back up as soon as they're consolidated here. We'll move against Pelagia, who doesn't seem to have much here or here, to be honest. So we should be able to stomp them down to here. Machaka is just rolling over everybody. It's ridiculous. They have the most of everything. They have double my income. Well, not they have double my provinces, double my armies, a lot more gem income, a little bit more gold income. The only thing I'm beating them in currently is Dominion. I have Sneak 2 here who's sneaking out. Skinch. I thought I had some more new guys. Thought I did. Oh, Kundera. Kandera's here. He's researching for the moment, but as soon as we're ready, we're going to move him out. We're just getting trying to get troops here for Ken is fast, Ancient Furnius, and Crazy Man. So now we, we have too many leaders and not enough people for them to lead. Unfortunately, they can't lead blood troops. That would be really nice. So as you can see, I'm recruiting tons of guys. And I'm recruiting a lot more of these protectors because they have the bodyguard attribute. So they're more likely to show up if, they're assassin if the people are attacked by assassins. So I'm looking forward to that. As far as research, we're moving full blood now to get the blood 7, Conjuration. Like I said, we have enough juice now to get Guardians of Eternal Ice. And I, well, I do have enough water gems to do it if you want to see it. What am I? Oh, Dalaman is summoning air, guys. I guess Starlid can do it. So we'll show you some Guardians of the Eternal Ice. Why not? Oh, right. Construction. There we are. And we're having Ignata Flipper Voice of Apsu, and we're we're having another one made. Another, where are you? No, Tzatziki's forging a bottle. We're having another water bracelet so that another one of these guys can also Voice of Apsu, since we need, we need to find water sites. Our end game is all about water gems, and we hardly have any of them. Maybe Voice of Tiamat would make some sense down here too, but it's just really expensive. It's just crazy expensive. We already did it here. We didn't find much, but in these two places, look like they weren't. This was searched by a death mage. And this, obviously, must have been searched by a water mage. So I, there's no point in searching this. Two other things here. We are recruiting, however, a Hydromancer, because they're nice. And I thought I had Ichthyids. But I'm out of money, so there you go. So that's what's happening. Everybody's just moving up. We're hoping Machaka decides not to declare war on us right now. Let's end the turn. Once Abyssia is down, then we're going full into Machaka. But this may be one of those games, folks, where we pull it out at the end by just getting enough thrones. Because Machaka is, is gigantic. And while my Dominion is spreading, that doesn't necessarily mean that the cold is going with it. We'll see. Dark Knowledge found nothing. Apsu. Oh, good! A Magic Sight in Foenshire. Ur has a new prophet. Ken is fast! Victim of assassination attempt. Will you live to see 
real battle, Ken is fast, or will you be taken down? You're by yourself? You're probably gonna die. Oh, well you took out your assassin, Ken is fast, so you quickly did that, but then... It appears I did give you bodyguards, it appears none of them just stayed with you. That's a shame, but you took out your assassin, that's more than can be said for some. Dre2D2. And as I said, folks, in the text of the first episode, this is Dominions. Anybody can die at any time, so I apologize, but it happens. Unless you're Dre2D2, in which case, they can just keep going. But where are they getting these assassins? I mean, this is incredible. Zoglia. Okay, this is our combined force of everyone. <laughs> There's more mages here than troops, honestly. And they don't have much promise defense. This should be a fun little game. I've upgraded everybody's casting, so they should all be frozen harding, and there we go. Wooden warriors, no? That was not part of the deal. Yeah, we're frozen harding them left and right. This is exciting. <laughs> oh, this is, this is fun, actually. There's straight 2D2. Or is that is that him, or is that just the regular bear rider? Yeah, it's a regular bear rider. Dre2. There he comes. There he comes. Oof. So that's what, that's what you get, folks, when you have an army of heroes who don't have any troops and are just standing around all game long. It's magical oblivion. How did that go in reality? We lost a fighter and that's it. Excellent. I'm surprised we have 150 guys. Half of them are probably just bodyguards for our mages. Oh man, I, I left Abyssia. So I guess they attacked me before I could, they sallied forth before I could exit? Oh good, oh good. Everybody got out, sure, whatever, bear, fine. I don't care. Lat Magic Man. Let's see if we can take these barbarians out. This is our new force with our buddies. Hey, you should be an ice elemental with our buddies. Balder. Zane Rogers and Tokshin should be somewhere too. Oh, there he is. So Tokshin's just hanging out next to the water. Elemental. Hopefully that won't... Well, you're cold resistant. I don't think that should be a problem. Let's see how these barbarians do. We do not have a priest with this army, so my ancestors are not going to be blessed, but they are ethereal. We are freezing mist. All of my Arc Mages are Freezing Mist at the beginning of the battle, twice, and then they skip to Falling Cross at that point. Which is basically doing more damage to the Barbarians than our actual troops are, it looks like. Ooh, that was awesome! And of course they're running, because no one wants to mess with that. No one at all. So how do we do, though? We lost 12 defenders, ouch, and 12 of our flying ancestors. We did take out 78 barbarians, but still, oof, 12 defenders. So we're gonna have to stop again, because that's not enough troops. Ladane, some earth gems, great. Would love a hero. I think I mentioned that before, some money. Zoglia, okay. Apparently they have enough in there to stop this army. So, oh good, oh good. We now have Fiends of Darkness, several of them. So they must have been hanging out inside the fortress the whole time I was sieging it. These guys are just going to stay put here. Okay. And that, yeah, that's really all they're going to do. They're just going to stay put. How are your bodyguards looking? Everybody's got full bodyguards. We're going to move up Skinch. So now we have some Blessing. A little bit too late for our... For our flying ancestors, but you do what you can. And now we have a ton of scary, undisciplined mammoths who are going to be Sermon of Courage, so that'll be that'll be good until the phoenix comes after us. I hate that guy. Percival? Was I going to give you anything else? Well, I hope not, because there's nothing here. You and Tazo are going to join the party as well. Oh, well, you can't? Okay. One step at a time, I suppose. Maybe Percival can. Person, no. So, maybe Tazar can? Nope. Okay, one step at a time. So it goes. So it goes. Blue Ice Wallace, I think you're ready to go. We're going to give you Reinvigoration. I think that's it. So you have your Shield, your Frostbrand, 
No armor, but your protection is 21 and your defense is 27, so you really don't need it. Magic resistance is good, but they're not going to cast any spells. You're, you're solid. You're a beast. And you have regeneration and reinvigoration. I don't think you have anything to worry about, but we're going to script you. And this might be the hardest part, is scripting to cast some spells, because you'll lose some of your power. But let's go with Liquid Body. And let's counter that with Quickness, because Liquid Body slows you down and lowers your strength. So Quicken Self. There we go. So that should that should get that back. And we're talking 20 fatigue, yeah, but but it's only a it's only a level two spell, and you're level three, so you'll be less fatigue. And this is only level one, so we should have less than the fatigue here. And finally, do I want anything like ice shield? Would be fun only underwater. Okay. Isn't there something that surrounds you in oh breath of winter? Yes. Oh yes. Breath of Winter. And then at that point you are going to hold to get your invigoration back and you're just going to go crazy. Attack whatever. Have fun. And we'll put you in the back to buy you some time to do all that. Alright, Blue Ice Wallace. For the glory of Ladane. We'll send you maybe we'll send you against the barbarians. Although they can pack a punch. I mean they're they hit hard. They might be able to... Maybe that's not the best thing for you. But definitely not Abyssians. I'm not entirely sure what to do with you just yet, Blue Ice Walls. Fire Lungs. Let's get you this. I think that's it for you. No, we should probably... If I recall correctly from Dre2 D2, he really benefited a lot from the reinvigoration and the regeneration. He really did. The regeneration especially. So we might just wait. We have plenty of nature. Well, we don't have plenty of nature gems, but I'd rather not lose you. We have a new mage. Battle mage? Who are you going to be? Daniel? Oops, oops, oops. Can't spell for a damn. Nemo. Finding Daniel Nemo. Okay, I'll give you some guardians before I send you out to fight. And that's it. The rest of you guys are researchers. Any other new friends here? Yep. Another major. Ooh, a three water. Absolutely. That's what I'm looking for. You're going to ice mist and froze falling frost. And you are 2XK. And you're old. Why are you old? You're just a regular mage. Well, have some boots of youth, I guess. Plenty where those came from. I'm... Colt, probably want to make want to make some more, actually. And Cold Feet, we'll just have you research right now until I figure out what I want to do with you. Probably empower you, but I don't know if we have enough yet to empower you. Everybody here is going to stay here. Starlet, Dr. Dalman, we'll get you back to research just for right now. So we can find something better for you to do. Hymus, let's share your gems with the, with the lads. Okay, all of you guys, back up here. What's going on here? We have Stamps and Capali's Tardis. We have a bunch of demons they can't lead. Alright, we'll put you here. So we have a lab for you. Unrest is getting up high here. Whoa, we have a new Ice Devil. This guy is... Oh, he's a ton of hit points and a Hell Sword. What is a Hell Sword? I don't think I've seen you before. Partial Life Drain? Oh yeah, you're going to thug it up. Surely, you're not going to lead anybody. You're just going to lead to destruction. And you are going to be... Dag, you're all? Hal... Halcyon? Halcyon? Dag, girl, Halcyon. Yeah, and you're... You're berserk! Oh, you're badass! And you're... You don't have that much water. So yeah, you're thuggish all the way. Let's get you somewhere we can give you items. Put you in the capital. That is a thing of beauty here. Okay, so problem is, though, if you're going to be thug, you're not going to lead troops. So we still need one of those. We can get another succubus, I guess. They're kind of expensive for what you get, though. An ice devil is not that much more expensive, and they can, well, sometimes they can lead a ton. Let's just try another one of those. And since the unrest is still a little out of control, glass miner, you'll continue to summon corrupted Ladane. Okay, wonderful. And we've taken this. 
This could use some defense, I suppose. These guys are all here just waiting for something to do. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Well, next turn, you're probably going to see me attack this castle with these guys. I don't know what to do about Abyssia, honestly. That phoenix is just destroying me, although... Is it is it true that they don't have any... They don't have any dominion here? Am I right in that? They have a ton of dominion here, but none here. In their cap. I could dominion kill them, maybe. That's an idea. Get rid of that filthy phoenix. But if they don't have dominion here, how is the phoenix surviving? I don't know. We'll have to monitor the situation closely here. Maybe we just need someone there to see the dominion. Because they apparently don't have any dominion here either. But they have a ton here. But I have a troop here. And not, you know what? I have a spy here. That's what it is. I don't think you can see the dominion of an area. I thought you could see dominion of places that were next door to you. You can. I'm confused. Oh well. That happens. We're just basically shuffling everybody to the front. Spending our money as we get it. Spending our gems as we get them. It's almost winter time again, which is our favorite time. These guys are such good little blood hunters, they don't cause any unrest at all. I don't know what the deal is here and why this is just unrest central. Especially this nice little ancient temple you think would keep things calm. But it is what it is, so thank you all so much for watching. Have a good one.